Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Exclusive Relax, and welcome to part. What I'm saying for part three of episode four, The Walking Dead: A New Frontier. All right, all right, all right. Stay alert. Be careful. You'll be fine. Okay. This will be great. We got this. Hopefully. Slow down, buddy. He needs to chill. No, you haven't, Keith. He's done it against zombies, where they kind of oblivious so to some stuff, you know. You make them in a split second, and then have to carry them. The rest but like of actual life. like humans, I haven't killed them and stuff. It's a whole different thing. Trust the right people, Not man. Not knew Richmond is bad. Some of them can be trusted. Seems like it's hard to know who to trust. It's not easy. Yep. Even your father got fooled. Scary part, you know? Like, who can you trust at all, if anybody? He's looking right at him. <laughs> like, literally looking right in the direction. Okay, so we gotta take him out. Anybody else can gonna come out? We can trust him. We can't, but that doesn't mean we can just kill him. Okay. Got to knock him out. Make any noise and attract any attention. Hey, I can go talk to him. Will you sneak inside? I'll distract him. He won't do anything to me. I'll tell him I saw something suspicious. All right, good idea. Let's try good it. Idea, Gabe. I, I can do this. I saw something. Show me. Okay, so he actually trusted him. Good, good, good. Getting inside. Still taking him away. So that's good. But the thing is, how are we? How is Gabe gonna come back? Unless he like makes a run for it or something. But. Sure. In. Luckily, that door didn't creak way too much. The alarm system is in honor. Metal detector, I mean. That's Gabe. I get because of the shoe. Yeah, okay. God damn, dude. Told you it would work. How'd you get rid of him? Don't want to know. Just don't want to know. Uh, these decisions are hard because we don't want to kill anybody. You know, we don't want to be those people. Really, really have to. But it's down here. Get to the point where we have to. The guns are through that door. Be locked, of course. Locked. No time to look for a key either. Noise. I have to do this the hard way. Dude, you already made noise. Just keep going. Oh, dude, just go. Already made the noise. Yeah, like once you make that first noise, like there's no turning back. Like you just have to go and do it. The thing is, how sure were they that nobody was in here? Crazy part, but everything's pretty much been. Oh, okay. I thought it was emptied out, but it's only the bullets that looked empty. <laughs> Dusty bat. Got some guns, weapons, bullets. Put these in your bag. Ammunition as well. We've never done this before. Just you and me. We make a pretty good team, right? <sighs> Uncle we do. One -two punch. <laughs> Not exactly. That would be fucked up. <laughs> 
Okay, that's not good. That's not a good team. That's not a good team. What the hell are you doing here? Okay, she can be on our side. She's gonna be on our side. Trying to help. I know you're pissed at me, but I want to do the right thing. For your brother. For him, for the rest of my family, for everyone. Yeah. It was a shit thing to do, fucking off on me like that. I know. I Why didn't you meet me at the stronghold? We had a plan. Dave is in trouble. My brother is in over his head and the water is rising. He needs our help. You're damn straight he does. But why should I trust you now? As far as I can tell, you're nothing but trouble. You gotta stop because Joan. What Joan is doing is wrong. I guess I can't really say no. Oof. Got him. And it looks like you could use all the help you can get. Nice. Awesome. I gotta grab something else real quick. Meet me by the front in five. Okay. This time we can't leave her. We gotta actually like stick with her. She's on our, she's on our side. Like man, last time we just trying to get Kate and everybody the hell out of there. I mean, waiting, way freaking Richmond is going. Come here. Hear that? I'm sure they heard that. Freeze! Whoa, 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 get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Get him. Oh, oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. God damn it, dude. Javi. Oh, Javi's injured. Are you okay? My God. Don't worry, kid. I'll be fine. Are you sure? I'm so but sorry. But that split decision, man. Why did he yes, do that I'll for, dude? Don't worry about it. We could ambush I'll him. Back to the others. Like him coming inside, we we could could have been on us, you Jeez, know. We could have got him. You guys alone for two minutes, can I? But him He's going after alive? him first. Yeah. Just passed out. Starting to think siding with you might have not been the best idea. Toss Sleeping Beauty in the closet so he sees him. Damn, he's using the—he's using the freaking arm that's cut, dude. That's gotta hurt. Let me see that wound. It's really bleeding. You're gonna need that taken care of. Shit. No, it's okay. Lingard and David are close friends. We can count on him to help you. Medical facility is right nearby. <sighs> It'll be quiet this time of night too. Oh. Okay. But let's be quick. Damn it. Okay. I mean, we really have no other choice, right? You just you gotta jump in there and do it. You're taking that. Somebody can obviously they're gonna see the blood, but the weapon not being there is a different thing. Damn it, Gabe. God damn it, man. God damn it, Gabe. God damn it. I mean, I get it. You know, he was trying to spring on him and trying to get the upper hand and everything, but he told him at the beginning, you know, split decisions are gonna. Are, are going to be the thing that you have to live with. So uh, I think if we would have let him come inside, it would have been easier for us because he would have been surprised by us. We would have had the upper hand. I mean, this was a surprise, but again, it's Gabe as opposed to somebody like Javi or David jumping in and get there. So the size difference, obviously gets overpowered. We, you know, luckily we dropped, we got them dropped the gun by slamming into him. So he didn't kill Gabe, um, but we did get our shoulder cut. So, I mean, at least Gabe isn't dead. Which again, this this game is looting. I, I I feel like it's looting to him also dying. Um, so that's not a good thing. Um, I, and and then again, we gotta see where Clem comes out and all this. If she even comes out in this in this episode, she might not be until later when they actually escape or when they need to escape or something. It all depends. But I guess we just gotta wait for next time and see what happens next. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, guys, if you guys like this video, hit that like button. If you want to watch more videos like this, you know, and also see the rest of the Telltale story with me, hit that subscribe button. As always, I'm Exclusive Lex. Welcome to the Exclusive Family. We're in for a hell of a ride. Take care, guys. See you next time.